we can disable access to windows 10 settings and control panel by using two methods in method one we can use group policy editor to disable windows 10 settings and control panel and we can also use windows registry editor which is used for who are the users unable to unable to access group policy so in the method one we are going to use group policy editor to disable the access for settings and control panel to do that press start menu and type group you can see the result as it edit group policy which is group policy editor and, and press enter to open the group policy editor in the group policy editor you can see the bunch of settings we are going to the user configuration and then in that user configuration we are going to the administrative templates and in that administrative templates we are going to choose control panel in the control panel you can see in the right side you can see the number of settings and options uh, where in the in the settings we are going to choose prohibit access to control panel and pc settings this is the one we are going to change the settings to make that disable so double click on the prohibit access to control panel and pc setting you will get a dialog box with three options one is not configured and second one is enabled and the last one is disabled so we need to enable this of the setting to make sure to prohibit the access to windows settings and control panel so we are going to select enable button and click apply and click ok so we are enabled the prohibit access to control panel and pc setting now let's check if we we can access or not by you go to settings press start and type settings press enter you can see the windows settings space is going open and closed automatically that means we are unable to access the windows pc settings now we are going to access control panel press start and type control panel press enter you can see error message this operation has been cancelled due to restrictions effect on this computer please contact your system administrator this means the control panel settings are restricted to access by any other user in this computer that means we are changing the settings in the group policy editor that's okay so if you want to bring back access to the control panel and pc settings just simply change the settings of this enable to not configured so we are going to again double click on the prohibit access to control panel and pc settings and change the enable option to not configured press apply and ok so now we can access again the pc settings it's simple we are accessing the pc settings and as well as control panel so we are accessing the uh, pc settings and control panel uh, uh, this is the very useful very useful setting for who use their system as a shared device or network device which is which is not an which is we can make them prohibit to access by the other users where no one want to change the control panel settings and pc settings so if you if you're not unable to access the group policy editor which is not available in the windows 10 home edition so we need to change the settings by using register editor but make sure there is a caution if you change any settings in the register editor this may affect your pc performance or even damage your pc so make sure you made a full backup of your pc and full make full backup of your register editor before changing any settings in the windows registry so we are going to disable the access to windows 10 settings and control panel access using register editor press start and type r e g e d i t which is register editor press enter so you can see uh, the keys and sub keys and tree in the tree form so now just follow my lead we are going to the exact location create a new key for unable to access the control panel and setting so first of all go to hkey current user expand the hkey current user key and next go to the software expand the software key and then go to the microsoft i mean expand microsoft you can see the microsoft expansion and in that microsoft go to the windows go to the windows the windows and go to the current version windows current version current version in that current version we are going to change we are going to expand policies so in that policies we can see explorer key explorer in the key so if you even selecting after selecting explorer go to the right side and right click on the right side create new new d word 32 bit value and give the name as 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 a as 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 i type it here capital n oh no capital c 
O N T R O L control capital P A N E L no control panel as it is with N capital C capital P capital without any spaces press enter we are created a D word value no control panel in the explorer key so we are going to change the no control panel value by double clicking the no control value to 0 to 1 which is enable the no control panel access in this computer as well as the PC settings so we are uh, disable the access to Windows PC settings and control panel settings by using Windows registry editor we need to reboot the system to get the proper action sometimes we don't need to reboot the PC but this by changing any settings in the registry editor we need to reboot the pc so if you want to again access if you want to again access the windows 10 settings and pc com control panel setting we need to simply change the value 0 1 to 0 which is disable the control panel disable access settings or simply delete this key so we can delete by delete right click delete so there is no no C, no no control panel d word value so we can access settings and control pane in this way we can disable access and re-enable access for certain users or in this way in the, in the shared computer by using windows group policy editor or windows registry editor thank you